Exterior, Winterfell Wall. The battle for Winterfell begins heavily adapted, believe it or not, for read-through purposes. <laughs> The Night King turns and sees Jon coming for him. Is this going to be an epic fight? No. The Night King raises his arms slowly. Jon knows what that means. The dead begin to rise. Shit. Jorah the Andal battles on. He has been slashed and stabbed, pummeled and pierced, but somehow he keeps fighting. Whites plunge their knives into him. He takes more punishment than Hodor took at the door, than Beric took in the Great Hall, and still somehow Jorah stands and defends his queen. Danny tries to rouse Jorah, but he is gone. Exterior, Godswood, the Night King walks with methodical, terrifying calm. He stops before Bran and raises his sword to strike, but something is hurtling toward him out of the darkness. Arya. <laughs> she vaults off a pile of dead whites, leaps at the Night King, and she plunges the dagger up through the Night King's armor, and the Night King shatters. <laughs> Wildlings and northerners have gathered around John. I saw him run. Dragonstone Beach, night. Grey Worm leads Varys, hands bound down the beach. I told you what would happen if you betrayed me. You did. Lord Varys, I, Daenerys, have passed Targaryen, first of my name, breaker of chains and mother of dragons, sentenced you to die. Dracarys. Drogon spews fire on him, but we don't watch our old friend burn. Instead, we see the reactions of those who knew him. Tyrion is heartbroken. Jon is disturbed. Grey Worm sees this as the just execution of a traitor. Did she sound like someone who's done fighting? She's a conqueror. She liberated the people of Slaver's Bay. She liberated the people of King's Landing. Our queen's nature is fire and blood. Standing before the Iron Throne, Danny steps forward and kisses the man she loves. A perfect kiss. Their eyes closed, his hand behind her head, her hand on his cheek. Danny's eyes open suddenly as she draws a sharp breath. John's eyes open as well, already filling with tears. For a moment, neither moves, as if moving will make this real. We see John with his hand still on the hilt of the dagger he just lodged in Danny's heart. Her strength leaves her, and she collapses to the marble. He keeps her in his arms, and she falls, kneeling down to the floor beside her. He looks down at what he's done, terrible and necessary. End of Game of Thrones. Ooh.